What's up, y'all? Welcome to episode 2 of Jazzin' with Z-Dog, with your host Z-Dog. Find me on Facebook, the link will be down below. So this is a quick one. I'm, today, I was going to see if there was any questions for you guys but I, about tonight's game, but I guess there's not. So let's recap tonight's game. Jazz looked good, just couldn't shots. So they're the same problem as last year. And Towns was going off. I, I'm not going to say this, but you, Jazz me, Jazz Nation agrees with me. The Jazz need a backup big man. Tony Br It's good that Tony Bradley didn't play today. Because he would have gotten demolished by Towns. Like, Gobert did what he can do. But it's just the Jazz need in our big man. And I hope in the offseason that happens. Or maybe during the trade deadline. Because it's possible. I'm going to say this. I, you had some fans are probably going to hate me, but I got a good feeling the Jazz might trade Exum. Like, for someone good. Don't hate me. Don't hate me. I, I just feel like it's going to happen. I miss uh, Jay Crowder, Ricky Rubio, Derek Favors Jazz, to be honest. But yeah, it, it was a close game against the Timberwolves, and then the Timberwolves blew open. I feel like if you're a Timberwolves fan, I feel like after losing to the Rockets, I feel like you they need revenge. And by the way, Conte Towns, you're a flopper. Oh my goodness, you are flopping all over the place. You're a homer, Towns. You're you're a garbage homer. God, you're ugly, Towns. That's why you'll never be an All Star. Hey man, at least Gobert might take your spot in the All Star Game Towns. But yeah, Jazz lost. We were undefeated at home, and now we're six and one at home and eight and five. That lost to Memphis last game was low key. We lost to the refs. So I'm telling you this: every game the Jazz play, we always lose because of the refs of the bad calls. And there's been a lot of bad calls so far. Like the one in the Memphis game where Mitchell went up for the three with the time right now. It looked like he had contact, but he did. So, yeah. Jazz lose to Minnesota. They didn't lose by a lot. At least it wasn't a blowout. I, I just don't like these close games. I, I, that needs to stop against the Timberwolves again in Minnesota. But, yeah, hopefully the Jazz will rebound. And beat them again in Minnesota. The Jazz got easy schedule coming up. Looking at those next couple of games, I think those are easy wins. I can't wait to see Favors return to, to Salt Lake. I heard I heard he's out with back spasms. That could be huge if he's out against the Jazz. You will think about it. You know what I think the Jazz should do for Favors? They should do a tribute video. I say that's a great idea. What do y'all think? But yeah, this is Jazz and Lucy Dog episode two. Uh, it's a short one today because I gotta get back on 2K20 and grind to 98. I'm already at 97. I'm literally close to hitting 98 on my point guard, so I want to do that. I just want to push out this Jazz and Lucy Dog for you. This is episode two. And yeah, shout out to the Jazz community. So if y'all have any feedback. About this episode, and if you have any requests, what I should do for the next episode, let me know. Yeah, find me on Facebook, add me on Facebook, the link down here or up below if you're on Facebook. But yeah, I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, Jazz Nation. Shout out to the Jazz community.